lay siege to a medieval castle. On this episode of Game Pass Picks, we're doing something a little different. Instead of doing one game, I'm going to give you five games that you need to play in the month of August. These games range from AAA to indie, but they all have one thing in common. They're on Xbox Game Pass, and they all are a lot of fun. Human Fall Flat might look like a simple physics simulator, but due to the hilarity and the way Bob moves and falls, and the extremely clever puzzles, Human Fall Flat is guaranteed to make you laugh within the first 10 minutes. Playing with a friend is encouraged, and as you can see by my captured footage, the mishaps you will get into with friends will have you both wondering what happened, but desperately trying to save each other as well. Whether you're a fan of puzzles or just having a good time, Human Fall Flat is for you. Human Fall Flat is available on console for Xbox Game Pass. Doom 2016 still feels extremely polished, and the sense of speed during action is unrivaled in the FPS genre. Doom will give players that love pinpoint accuracy in weapons and finding secrets hours and hours of gameplay that cannot be found anywhere else. Glory kill your way to victory and hone your skills before Doom Eternal launches in November 2019. Doom is available for Xbox Game Pass members on console. If you like deck building card games and turn based combat, Slay the Spire is the game you never knew you wanted. Slay the Spire is a roguelike combined with deck building to create one of the most unique and time sucking games ever. While each death means the player must start over, they will unlock new characters and cards along the way, keeping the gameplay fresh every time you start a new plunge. Don't let the roguelike elements keep you from playing this one. I guarantee you give it 20 minutes and you will be hooked. And before you know it, it'll be 10 hours later. Slay the Spire is currently available on Xbox Game Pass for PC and is coming to Xbox Game Pass for console on August 14th. Okay, you're a big fella. Easy now. With Gears 5 right around the corner in early September, it's time to revisit the Coalition's first attempt at Gears with Gears of War 4. While it isn't the strongest out of the gate, the campaign is still a blast to run through by yourself or with a friend. And after that, why not hop into some horde mode and see how long you can survive the 50 waves of Onslaught. To this day, no other cover shooter feels as good as Gears. So rev up those Lancers and get ready for Gears 5. Gears of War 4 is available on Xbox Game Pass for console and PC. The Messenger is a 2D side-scrolling adventure that will continue to make you laugh with its humor, but keep you engaged with its tight controls and stellar gameplay. After you pick up the controller and feel just how much fun it is to hop from enemy to enemy without touching the ground while listening to some of the best chiptunes in years, you will understand why this is a must-play for anyone with Game Pass. The Messenger is available on Xbox Game Pass for PC. And that's going to wrap it up for this episode of Game Pass Picks. Let us know what games you like from the list in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button, it really helps us out, and we'll see you next time.